I can't think of any car that epitomizes the 50s better, especially 1955, than this uh, Chevy Bel Air hardtop. Uh, the colors are coral and gray. A very popular combination. The owner tells me it was only available this year, in 1955. Notice the wide white walls and the full wheel covers. Great trim on this car. It's really perfect. Notice the surround there on the uh, gas tank uh, door. Interior is perfect. Original type materials and I had forgotten there are chrome bows on the uh, our top here in 1955. Really gives you the convertible look. And notice the uh, two-toning here of the upholstery. And uh, the Kleenex dispenser underneath the glove box there. Power glide. Beautiful uh, dash with the Chevy emblems. Lots of them in the uh, background there on the dash, which I always thought was very clever. And moving towards the back of the car, we have a Continental kit. I know some will like and some will not, but it seems natural for this car. This has V8, of course. First year for that. 265, I believe. Nice two-toning on that spare wheel. The paint is exceptional. Everything about the car is exceptional. If you wanted a, a perfect representation of 1955, this has to be it. There's the gravel guard there in the front. The clock underneath the speaker. Deluxe uh, steering wheel. Just very, very nice. And of course the jet plane.